Guys, welcome back to Spooking Let's Play Medieval 2. Alright, let's go ahead and continue. Let's see, we had to open up a door on this side, I believe. Yeah, this side. So let's go on in. And we have another vampire puzzle, yet again. Okay, so this one seems like I hear a health thing. It'd be up here. Come on. There we go. Okay, so you see a bell over there. And this is actually the last part that I uh, actually know about then. The rest will be blind. But uh, you see a bell there, and actually if you hit that, it will wake them up, the uh, the vampires. But also, uh, if they do wake up, you can uh, put them back to sleep by hitting the bell, which is, you know, it's like a... It's a, it's a double... Double negative, almost. But anyways, um... You have that, and also I actually need to go up here. Shit! And also, if you hit the, uh, the green parts on the, uh, the green tiles on the floor, that'll also trigger the, uh, fucking mother, god damn it. That'll trigger the, uh, the coffin to, uh, open and wake up the vampires. Thank you. So, yeah. So let's see if we can actually, uh, never even thought to do it this way. So I wonder if I can just throw him straight into the fire. Come on. Sweet. That works. I actually didn't do it that time. I actually took him out, out this side the last time I did this. So actually, this is, this is way easier. Cool. Alright. They're dead. And with that, that'll actually give me the last amount that I need for the uh, chalice as well. So, with that in mind, let's go ahead back and uh, get the uh, chalice. Actually, it, with that. No, wait, sorry. Sorry. I'd be lying to you guys. I have to kill this butcher first. Which, what's down here? It, hmm. Ah, life bottle. I'll take that. Come on. There we go. Now we can collect the chalice. Alrighty. So let's go get that. I'm curious to see what the next weapon is. Hopefully it's something better than an enchanted broadsword. I just do not like those things at all. Not a fan. Enchanted anything. Just never worth it in my mind. Now, if it's like a flame arrow, well, I'll take that. I'll take that any day. Because those things are hella good. Especially in the first game. I wonder if you even get them in this game. I, I don't even know if you get them in this, in this game. I honestly can't remember. Okay. Alright, so... It looks like I have to push. Alright. Oh, okay, because it's the coffins there. Alright. Alright, I'll save myself some time. Okay, I gotta push him in. Okay, I have to, like, trap him. That's too big to... Alright. Oh, wait. Okay, okay, okay. I think I got it. I think I got it. Maybe... Put this on this side. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That should do. And then get them to follow me, and then I'll just trap them in, and then put. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That'll work perfect. Oh God. That won't work perfect though. Go back down. Thank you. Come on. Jesus Christ. Alright. Down again we go. I don't know why, like, oh my god, why is it so hard? 
It shouldn't be this hard. It honestly should not be this hard. Jump. I wish I could just break it like this. Alright. Don't even worry about stopping. Don't even stop. Okay, uh... Yeah, we better do one at a time, just in case. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on! Follow me. Follow me. Alright. Block him in. And up he goes. Cool. That was easy. Now I just gotta do it another one more time. Come on. And we'll be good. Shit. Follow me. Shit. Did not think this one through. Alright, this way. Over here. Now we can push him. Okay. Alright. Oh, so I've been playing this, uh... Oh, God. I've been playing this, uh... No, it's not really a new game. I mean, it's uh, it came out maybe last Christmas ish. I think so. Yeah, that's nah, not new at all. Anyways, uh, uh, the latest, I guess, Castlevania game, Castlevania Lords of Shadow. I've been playing that recently. I'm curious. What do you guys think about that game? Oh my God, what did I do? What do you guys think about that game? I've, cause I've been putting in quite a bit of hours in that game, and I honestly don't know what to think of it because at times I think it can be so awesome but at other times it just seems like the worst game ever because of the fact that it just makes me so angry and it just seems like it lasts forever and ever and ever and ever and ever oh my god this looks very dangerous uh I don't even know what to think about this um Let's hit the switch. Okay. Alrighty, so... I'm slightly confused on what I'm supposed to be doing here, but alright, let's let's go the other route, I guess. Um, but yeah, I mean... I mean I've gotten... Uh, I guess, technically, two-thirds... Alright, oh god, that's the chessboard. Um, okay. I'm trying to figure out which... I guess the green part there means I can go on that. So that means I can't touch any in the... Ah, that's gonna suck. Alright, I think I can remember that kind of. Shit. Although I don't really care about that right now. I, what I really care about is uh, getting these stupid light on. Because uh, I can't do anything else until I get that done. Um, but anyways, yeah. Uh, Castlevania, Castlevania. That's right. Um, but yeah, like I said, I got two-thirds of the way through the game. It just... I don't know. It seems way too uh, repetitive. I mean, I know it's kind of... Asking a lot for, fuck, for you know, because Castlevania is in essentially it is a repetitive game. I mean, you have a whip. You, you're, every single game's objective is usually to kill Dracula. So I mean, of course there's gonna be some repetitiveness, I guess. But I don't know. I just didn't necessarily expect the amount. I just feel like the game's just way too long, honestly. Okay, so I can't move this. Oh, 
Okay. Alright. Um... See, this one can go that way. Sorry, I'm concentrating a little bit. And this one. I'm thinking. Shit. Shit! Shit! I should have known. I should have known. Go back to bed. What the fuck? <sighs> Come on. Damn it! Don't hit anything. Okay. Um, I need to figure out. No! What I need to figure out is I need to figure out the pattern again, because I don't understand why it's not the correct pattern. God damn it! I just want to find the... Huh. I'm gonna at least finish this before the fucking video ends. Okay. Those bastards. Okay, so I had to push it. That's so stupid. I did it that way. That's bullshit. That is just bullshit. Alright. That's your way game. Down you go. Come on. Yeah. Burn, you motherfuckers. Sweet. Not gonna lie, that was kind of a pain in the ass. Alright, well, at least it's done. Let's see what the next room is. Maybe it's health. <laughs> That'd be nice. I would love some health. Eh, don't fall. Really? Oh god, boss. Okay. Hmm. You gonna load anytime soon? Game? Thank you. Alright, Dan, you've come a long way. I'd save if I was you. Why, thank you, Tiny Tim. I would love to. I haven't saved in quite a while. Actually, no, I saved like last episode. But, anyways. Come on! Whatever was through Dick's door is a lot worse than the stuff you've already encountered. Use your wits, not just your weapons. Reflect on what I've seen. Mm, Kadoki. Will do. Alright. And actually, you know what? I'm going to end it just a little bit early. Um, we'll do the boss fight in the next episode. So, thanks for watching again, guys. And I'll see you next up. Later.